We are live from Greenland, near the settlement of Narsarsuak, where a new complex of oil installations is launching today. And now the CEO of the Greenland Oil Company, Steve Parrish, will host the grand opening. Fix the malfunction now! Of course I won't, son. Go to sleep. Imagine you're flying through the clouds into a fairy tale world where elves and gnomes live, where you are a hero defeating villains. That's scary. Don't be afraid. I'm right here. I'm in the orc's lair. Perfect. So far, everything is going as planned. Marin said the artifact we're after looks like a <sighs> spherical stone. Where can it be? There it is. This artifact. And now it's time to get out of here before the orc wakes up. The orc was making something here. Perhaps I'll find something useful.
it's you. How did everything go? There were minor problems with... <laughs> Sometimes it feels like you enjoy watching me suffer and then show up at the last moment to help. I'm never late, but I'm never early either. I'm there exactly when needed. Did you get the Impaler? Impaler? I got this. This is it. A tool that can cut through space. My new teleportation artifact. Now we don't need to look for all those ancient dolmens to travel somewhere. Cool. Cool. What is it? Oh no. Save us, Mount Gaul. Has this really happened? What? Follow me. We are going to the Great Tombs. There, you will understand everything. This is the Drac Square, a complex of tombs built for the four deities of the Lost Lands. You will learn more about them later. Now we need to find Hillamir, the local keeper. It looks like a sketch of some kind of hiding. Hillamir, my friend, are you home? Perhaps he is walking among the tombs. We should look for him there. This is the gate of the worlds. They were built by the deities to connect our worlds. Hmm. Reminds me of our Stonehenge. Hey you! Do not touch anything there! Hello, Hilamir. I think you can see what brought me to you. My staff... Just like my pendant, this is a signal. The cache has been opened. The heart must be saved, however. We won't make it on Earth without a local guide. This is Susan. She is from Earth. Really? If you are truly from Earth, then we have a chance. It is in your power to save us all. How often have I heard that? <sighs> what happened this time? A relic from our world has been found on Earth. The heart of the ancient deity of magic whose name is Dracul. It just so happened that your people killed Dracul long ago. His body was returned to us. But the heart was lost in your world. As long as his heart is alive, magic lives in our worlds. That is why we must not allow your priest to experiment with it. Okay... What is my role in all this? You will go to Earth, find the heart of Ul, and bring it back here. That's it? The construct behind you is the gate of the worlds. You need to set it up to connect with the Earth. Once you enter the void, collect the particles that the gate feeds on. What kind of particles? And why do we need them? I'll tell you more about it later. To enter the void, you must start the core of the gate. It is an underground mechanism. Take this key. It will open a passage to the core. You should fill this vessel with particles of the void.
This portal will take you to any place you imagine. I advise you to go where it will be easiest for you to begin your search for the heart. When you find the heart, sprinkle it with particles of the void. They will turn the heart into a portal. Grab it and imagine the place we are now. When you return, find Marin or me immediately. When you come back, find me first. The heart should not fall into the wrong hands. It can be used to revive Dracul, and this could end badly for all of us. Believe me, we cannot allow this to happen. Got it. Well, wait for me. We may have to wait a few months. Maybe years. Right, women. No, that's because time flows differently in our worlds. Ah. Oh, home sweet home. Anyone here? Honey? Where is everyone? Okay, I need to figure out where I could find this... heart. I should probably watch the news. We always had some cash in the safe right behind the photo. I could really use some money right now. I forgot the code for the safe. I remember that Michael sent me a message with a new password many years ago. I need to remember that day. So, it was daytime, and I came back from a run. I think I remember something. My phone was on the table, and it was completely dead. Then I connected the phone to the charger. been that long? Oh no, I got so used to the fact that time flows differently there that I completely lost track of it. We were looking for you! Where have you been all this time? <sighs> oh, I can guess though. Forgotten regions of yours, right? Lost lands. Screw them. I don't want to hear about it, Mom. What's going on with you? 
First dad and I bailed you out from the cops, then the feds come poking around about you, and then you completely disappear for like half a year. I'm sorry, Jimmy. I must. You know it, you've been there. They need my help. Why does it have to be you, exactly? I don't know, but they rely on me. Jim, you can't even imagine how many times our world was in danger and I have managed to prevent the tragedy. Okay, but so why did you come back all of a sudden? Something happened. Today, a relic of the Lost Lands was discovered somewhere on Earth. It is the heart of an ancient deity. I must find it and steal it before it's studied. I could really use my laptop. Where is it? Do you know? Help me, Jimmy. Why should I help you? I'm your mother, Jimmy. You didn't forget that, did you? <sighs> Promise me that after this is over, you'll return home to Dad and start living a normal life. I promise. We moved all your things to the bedroom. Oh my god, what a mess you've made. That's Dad. He tried to find answers. He couldn't figure out where he'd gone. <sighs> okay. I hope my laptop is still here.
Is this the incident Great Grandma Laura was involved in back in the 60s? It happened a long time ago. That's not it. At least I have nothing to do with that. That's it. It's in Greenland. It's a waste of time. There's probably a ton of military there already. They won't let you in. Oh, you're right. You know, in the other world, everything is much simpler. <sighs> I can't believe I'm saying this, but I will help you. Just don't ask why, okay? What? You just said they wouldn't let us in. Did you forget I'm a journalist? I'll talk to the channel's management. Pretty sure they'll fund the trip to cover this accident. We are approaching! to the barracks. They should meet you there. I can't see anything. Where do we go? Look, it seems like the generator's working. We need to connect it to the wires. Water delivery? Laura James, special reporter for TV Elf 12 USA. This is my cameraman, Jim Shepard. What? Journalists? Already? Have you not been informed that the press conference will be held tomorrow night? I'm sorry, Mr. Agent Otto Clausen, DSIS. 
I'm not allowed to let you in until tomorrow morning. That's the rules. Don't worry. We'll just go to bed and return tomorrow for the conference with all the journalists. Ma'am, this is a closed facility. You can't stay here longer than regulated. I'm going to call a helicopter. It will take you to Nasusuak. One minute, Agent. I want to talk with my partner. Jim, we have to do something. Help me. We can offer him money. Oh, God. I've never offered a bribe in my life, especially to a military... I'm afraid. Ugh, okay, I'll try to settle it up myself. Just give me the money. Son, take him aside and try to distract him for ten minutes. I will try to come up with a plan B in case the agent won't take the bribe. Uh, Agent Clausen, can I have a few words? I have a great offer. What else? Well, well, it's the first laxative. I think I can use this. I'll make a truly refreshing coffee for the agent. Okay, you can stay here, but keep your nose down until tomorrow morning. Got it? Yes, yes, thanks, Agent. We are so grateful. Here, have a cup of coffee. Coffee? Don't try to get more favors from me, Mrs. James. Please, Agent, it's just a sign of gratitude. Sorry. I need to leave for a moment. Don't go anywhere. <clears throat> Dirty method. Don't be a smartass. I knew it. Stonehenge is the gateway to our world. <laughs> Come on. Is that true? Yeah. It's worth remembering. Artifacts tied to the heart can be stored here. I hope we can find something useful.
Provide your name for authentication. What would you do without me? Uh, fortunately, I recorded our conversation with Agent Clausen just in case. Call it my journalistic gut feeling. Oh no, something went wrong and the notes on the tape recorder are mixed up. Agent Otto Clausen. Judging by the reports of the research team, the entrance to the cave is located somewhere behind this rubble. You could use that crawler crane with a giant magnet and clear it all up. Right! What? Are you for real? I was joking! The indicator shows there's no fuel. We need to find a fuel generator for that crane.
I can't believe you did it. There's a cave. Let's go. So it's true? This is really a Now I will take the heart off the pole and travel to Lost Lands. And what about me? What should I do now? We've made all this mess! We've made this huge mess! You're gonna disappear again and the feds will interrogate me again! What am I supposed to tell them? That you flew off to Neverland? Son, just put it all on me. Tell them you knew nothing, that it was my plan, that I am absolutely crazy. Everything will be fine. Nothing will be fine! You're gonna be gone for another year, and I won't even be able to tell anyone where you are, because no one will believe me! I know. I know. I'm sorry. This is the last time. Freeze! Get down on the floor with your hands behind your back! Jim, help me! I will have to shoot if you... Oh no, no, no! I'm here again! Mom, what have you done? Calm down, Jim. We will just give the heart to Marin and return home. Marin? Are you here? Here is the entrance to the tomb. It seems something is being repaired here. Let's look around. that reliefs for the eaves of the tomb were made here.
heart of Ul. There it is. Finally. What are you going to do with it? <laughs> Your time has come, Master. Marin, what are you doing? You said... What are you doing? who revived you. I will serve you faithfully. Give me your grace. Marin, no! Marin! Mom, no! It's too late! <laughs> Where is Ul? Oh, I saw him disappear into the woods. We need to check the ruins. There are still chances Marin can be saved. Mom, I'm sorry for your loss, but don't be naive. Hush! Do you hear that? Listen, someone's knocking behind the wall. I think it's coming from behind the closet. Can we move it somehow? Wow, it turns out that Hilamir has skeletons in the closet. I need to light a candle to fill the bowl. I know you're weak now, Marin, but we really need a fire. Thank you. How long was I gone, Marin? Why are you here? Why do you look like this? Where is Hilamir, and, and, and why did I witness your death under the ruins of the tomb? So, it was the collapsed tomb. I was wondering about the reason for that earthquake. Tell me the whole story, Susan. Dracul is alive. He was revived by you. It wasn't me. It was Hilamir. He betrayed us. He realized I suspected him of deceitfulness. So he decided to put me here, and he took my form to get the heart from you. Why would he do that? That's what we need to find out. What were his motives for doing such a horrible thing? And what is most important, what were his future intentions? Wait, please, just wait! We're not going to solve this. 
Mom, you promised you'd bring the heart to the Tin Man and come back home. Don't you care that I got myself into this mess because of you? Hmm, this young man? Yes, this is my son. Jimmy, the situation has changed. You need to understand that global changes in one world can affect the state of another. We can't just let things run their course. What are we supposed to do? Hillamir has a casket where he keeps his diary. One day he opened the casket right in front of me, and I memorized the order of the symbols. He was really careless to do that. In order not to forget them, I scrawled them on the floorboard and covered it with straw. There's nothing here. The diary is empty. But I saw with my own eyes that Hilamir wrote something in Hilamir writes that he built a house right above- A door right under the floorboard, huh? Mom, you're not really going- Someone had camped out there, and it seems that it happened a long time ago. We need to check the camp first. Maybe you will understand what happened here.
This is the stone bridge that was mentioned by Helamir. There must be a temple somewhere behind it. I have a strange feeling that someone's watching us right now. We need to cross the bridge, son. Follow me and keep your eyes open.
This is most likely the entrance to the temple. Now we have to do something. Haha, oh, perfect. They have the artifact. I need to make a clay bowl where I can prepare a potion.
Volner. Hello, Susan! For the moment, I thought that you are... What happened? Where am I? What a meeting! I mean, what are the odds? I decided to wander for a while, and I, I, I thought about going right to the Lost Lands. I was just passing through these dungeons when I heard a loud noise and the sound of water. I ran for the hills, and then I bumped right into you. <laughs> the flood carried you into the gorge and ruined the bridge to boot. You were almost drowned. Hold on. I think I remember you. It was my first visit to the Lost Lands. You... They call me Uri. Yeah, right. You helped me to find my son. How is your little man doing? Oh, he, he's not so little anymore. And it's really complicated. We don't have the best relationship right now. He thinks the Lost Lands are more important to me than my family. And what do you think? I think that my son... My son? Uh, Jimmy! Uh, he was with me on the bridge. W where is he now? I haven't seen him yet. Pull back the reins. Maybe he's still there. Let's get out of here. I don't want to lose him again. What is this place? I can't tell you for sure, but I've heard that these gorges belong to the Ulakian goblins. They are the ancient worshippers of the cult of Dracul. Mm. We're at the bottom of the gorge. Unfortunately, there are no stairs to climb up. I don't know what to do. We can try to build a raft to reach that rope. image from the Ulakian notes, there should be the same round tile in this altar as there was in the pulpit. I'm sure these are no ordinary tiles. I think it's the statue of the deity worshipped by the locals. What is this wreckage? It's a bridge! I- Jimmy! Son? He must have gone to the temple. Holy mushrooms! I always dreamed of seeing this temple firsthand! Ah! The door is just closed! We're trapped! I can see Jim! Mom! Thank God you're okay! Um... Who's this with you? I'm Uri. Jimmy, don't you remember me? Yes, I remember something. And I remember very well your sadistic brother. Come on, Jim, that was a long time ago. You'd better show me what you found. Let's find that moon tile and get out of here.
It is clear now where the goblin stole the statue.
At the dawn of the universe, when the deities and titans determined the forms of existence of the world, there were four Drakks, two brothers, and two sisters. They were Drak Og, the god of crafts, Drak Om, the goddess of science, Drak Yar, the goddess of culture, and Drak Ul, the god of magic. Drax were instructed to teach their knowledge to the mortals when the worlds were ready for it. The strength of the Drax was in the symbols they carried. Drak Og had a hammer. Drak Om had scales. Drak Yar had a fan. While Drak Ul had a staff. Drak Ul was known for his unstinting greed and for that he was exiled to the earth by his relatives. However, he had to suffer for his previous deeds even there. He was killed by the earthlings. Drax came to the earth to take the body of their dead brother and move it to the tomb in the Lost Lands. They divided the staff into three parts. The pole, the spearhead, and the topping, they hid them from the worshippers of their dead brother. Wait, don't do that. If you take the artifact, the temple door will seal and the water will start filling the place. And folks, we have guests. Oh no, these things are not for me. How did you manage to get there? The thing is, the Temple of the Universe is located right under this square. So what did you find out? Each drach has its own unique element that gives them power and strength. In the case of Ul, it is a staff. One end of the staff has a magical topper, while the other one has a spearhead. Do you really know where to find them? We already have the spearhead. There is no magical topper in the temple, but I know where to find it. However, I have no idea about the current location of the staff itself. I think I know. And who are you? And where did you come from? I helped Susan during her first visit to our lands. The question is, who are you? I have been helping Susan for the rest of the time. And where have you been? I... Stop! Where is the staff itself, Uri? <laughs> I, uh... I don't know for sure. I mean, uh, it, it might not be the staff. However, it looks pretty similar. Uri! The mountain giants have it. The mountain giants. Maybe Uri is right. I've also heard the legend that giants were honored to protect the relic of the deities a long time ago. According to the same legend, the relic was some kind of a pole. So, are we going to visit the giants right away? We shouldn't give Ul an opportunity to get even a single part of the staff. No way! I've had enough! We have to get it done, Jimmy. You are free to take Santa and the elf and do whatever you want. Just leave me alone! Jim? Come back here! Don't touch me! I want to be alone! 
Don't worry. I'll look after him. Go to the Giants. Jim and I will wait for you here. We need to find the top of the staff before heading to the Giants. Mount Gore, what happened here? It looks like someone's blood. I think it belongs to a giant. There can't be any other option. Let's get these things out of the way. Hey, who do we have here? Don't be afraid of me, sweetie. I'll set you free. Come on, Fluffy, come out. The village was attacked by someone. <sighs> Let's look for survivors. A lake? It's in the crater, all covered with ice. And there's the heavenly stone in the center. The giants call it the Dragon Tooth. Well, look at this. Are you tailing me now? Did 
Did he find something? What are you doing, Fluffy? Oh, thanks. This tint stands apart from the others, so there might be someone important in it. Is the what is she trying to tell us? This is the giant sign language. I don't know it very well, but uh, I'll try to read it. The prophecy has come true. Dracul rose from the dead. He came back. He needs strength and power. He's looking for it. His staff. I didn't quite understand this moment. It seems that they didn't want to tell him the place where the staff is hidden, and he killed the whole tribe for that. But Ul is a powerful deity. Uh, he will find the staff. Lady, um, shaman? We need this staff. We came to protect it from the power of Ul. She wants to know who we are. We are the Guardians. Our order is long gone, but our ideas continue to live. There is an island. No one can see it. Uh, there is a tree on the island. The staff is in that tree. How can we find the island? Unfortunately, you're doomed to failure. She says that Ul is stronger and more powerful than we are, even without the staff. Only the creature of the same divine nature is able to cope with him. This is it. What do we do next, Marin? What are you thinking about? I think our ways will part here. What? Why is that? I can't tell you, because I'm not sure my mission will succeed. But you have to continue your journey. Follow the path given by the shaman. Find the island. But how? Start with his tent. Look for clues. And I kindly ask you not to burn the shaman. Ha ha. Just go.
Is this the hidden island that I seek? It doesn't look too hidden. Maybe it's a totally different place. I need to look around. Giants. They cut their hands, and the blood is pouring on some... Wait! I've... There is an island no one can... There is a tree on the island. The staff is in the tree. Got it. I need to prepare the storm paint.
There it is! The last element of the staff! I would never think they would send such a louse to stand against me. Jimmy? My boy? Are you okay? Mom, forgive me for running away. I was a fool. I should have listened to you. It's my fault. I... Oh, please. Spare me from this sloppy sentimentality. Let them go, Ool. First, I will get my staff. In this case, you have to fight someone your own size. Marin? Finally! Ha ha ha! With you? Yes, Lost Lands are not what they used to be, and the heroes got low. I'm tired of beating around the bush with you. I'll kill the boy first, and then... Wait! Don't do that! No, uh, if you need someone's life, take mine. But don't hurt the boy. Really? Well, only because you ask. Ah! <sighs> no! You wanted to fight me, didn't you? No, not me. Jimmy? Son, where are you? What was that?
Baby, are you there? There you are. <laughs> Mommy is already... <laughs> I need a ladder. Uh, there it is. What a mess. I'm here, son. I'm with you. Mom, don't leave me. Of course, sweetheart. I would never do that. Mom, don't leave me! Mom, don't leave me! Jim, what happened? Oh, thank God. Mom, you're alive. I'm so sorry. Can you walk? Volner, uh, I mean, Tarsus will win us some time. But we need to hurry. Where's Dracul? Tarsus pushed him off the floating island and took him somewhere to the mountains. Ah, uh, I never thought I'd say this. But Volner's sacrifice plays into our hands. Now we have our own Tarsus to help us. The thing is, Tarsus appeared in the same way as Drax. They have a common nature. Therefore, Tarsus can stand against Ul as equal. What about Uri? There was nothing we could do. What is our plan, Marin? <clears throat> well, honestly, uh, this is the first time I've been so confused. I don't know what to do with this staff. It's incredibly huge and heavy. We can't take it anywhere quickly or easily. My magical abilities are severely limited now. In addition, I've lost my space impaler. I hate to admit it, but we're trapped. <laughs> Uri. Poor Uri. Hold on, I have an idea. I think I'm starting to understand things here. Long story short, I saw the courtyard of the Citadel. There's a tower with a ballista on the top of it. It also offers amazing views of the tombs where Uol managed to break free. Savvy? You propose to launch the staff with ballista? Right to the tomb? What for? Not the tomb, to the Stonehenge, or whatever it's called here. If I understand right, there's a portal in the stone circle. The entrance is located in the Lost Lands, and the exit is in our world. But this portal is destroyed on Earth. I think I'm getting the idea, too. He wants to say that you can lure Ul into the portal, close it, and destroy the gates. Then Ul would be trapped in the void. Maybe you are right. And how do we lure him? His staff will serve as the bait. It still won't work. Imagine that we throw the staff into the portal. I need to touch the gates to open it. I can't get there faster than Ul. 
Leave it to me. First of all, we need to get to the Citadel. I want to take a closer look at this ballista. I think I've lost all my belongings. They must be somewhere here. We have to bury him. We'll have time for that after we beat Ul. If we spend more time here, someone will have to bury us. Fluffy, where have you been? What? Do you want me to follow you? Marin, hold the lantern. Jim, hold this stencil. Lift it up above your head. There's the tower. We need to go upstairs. Well, let's start by bringing the staff up here. 
we can use the winch. And we need to find some kind of chains. Shackles, shackles, yeah, take the shackles, we'll need them. What do you have in mind, Jim? I suggest you trust the young man, Susan. Take a look. The ballista is equipped with a large monocular device on this image, most likely for aiming. Wow, that's a lot of saws. We need a two-handed saw.
Now let's try to adjust the monotony. Okay, Mom, we're almost done. We need a hammer and shackles. To be honest, I don't fully understand what you're up to, but I want to trust you, son. Thanks, Mom. Time is running out, and every minute is precious. Okay, Jim, tell us your plan. So, from here, you can see the gates of the worlds. We need to get the staff up here and put it in the ballista. Then we aim at the gates and fire. I really hope the power of the ballista and the length of the rope in the winch will be enough for the distance... And then we... Please, no. Anything but that. You're right. We ride the rope like a zipline. I feel sick. How do you want to go down the rope? I think a chain would be the best option. We can use it to throw it over the rope. This is pure madness. What was I hoping for? And, and what makes you think the power of a ballista will be enough for such a long shot? Mom, I know there's almost no chance, but we don't have any other option. So I'll do it anyway. With or without you. Uri died for me. I can't just drop everything and leave. You may die. Yes, but I'll regret it for the rest of my life if I don't try. I'm sorry, Jimmy. 
I was never able to give you what you really needed. Really? Well, who's been protecting me all these years, huh? Who took care of me and our world? <sighs> I think my mother is a superhero. Well, okay. Let's do it together. I'll keep my promise, Jim. Uh, don't be so categorical. I think I'm getting really involved. <laughs> <laughs> Nevertheless, I have to admit that the lost lands are still the same. And the heroes didn't get low. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do now? There's a little business I need to take care of. I owe a favor to an old friend. 